Welcome back ladies and gentlemen, Cowboy here, and it's time to get part four of our Dynasty Warriors Ambition Mode playthrough kicked off. So I got good news and bad news for you to start things off. Good news, I guess we'll start with the good news. We uh, got quite a few different uh, requests for weapons. Um, let me pull up my little list here real fast. So right now on the request list I got the Mace, Twin Axes, Tomfa, Javelin, Flail, and then someone requested uh, or wheels, and someone said ring. And I think by rings, rings and wheels are the same thing, I'm assuming. So uh, we went through our weapons, looked at what could work with Lubu, and of course we got four-star compatibility with our Twin Axes and with our Tomfas. So Sun and Moon and Infernal Tiger. Both of these bad boys are coming out this time around. If you were wondering why I decided to switch up the outfit, I figured, uh, you know, the traditional big giant badass Lubu outfit probably wouldn't look too cool with the Tomfas, whereas I figured this one would look better. Um, the bad news, however, is uh, if you remember in the last episode, got some uh, some new homies in my camp. You can see uh, Peng Tong, Zhu Xu, Zheng Bao, Lu Bei, and um, I basically assigned them as supervisors, you know, because I'm like, yeah, supervise shit. I guess that I, I wasn't really paying attention to the tutorial. I have to like go back through I guess like the part one let's play and watch what I was actually supposed to be doing with supervisors. But anyway, uh, because I chucked them in there, I can't change to them right now. So I got to unlock three new people, three battles in a row, or I don't know, maybe four people. Either way, I got to do three battles in a row and get some more people so I can switch it up outside of Lubu. But I'm quite excited for Jushu because he is a straight up fucking baller. I just finished the shoe campaign. And he's, he's just nasty. He has like, yeah, his uh, his weapon is basically like a sword that has like a, uh, a rope coming out of it with a blade on the end of it. His Musao is like fucking Omni Slash. He's just awesome. So for now, he's my new bodyguard because, you know, well, we all know what was happening with uh, Zhang Bao over here getting kind of weird, confessing his feelings for me. Lubu and about that life. Either way. I uh, remember we needed to increase fame, so let's, um, guess we'll start at Guandu. Let's get our fame up. Let's whoop some ass with some Twin Axes and Tomfas. I know the other weapons I looked through, Lubu has, like, either one or two-star compatibility with them, so... Wheels, Javelins, and Flail will have to wait till we have, uh, someone who can actually kind of use them. Defeat the enemy, elite enemies. Hang on, where the fuck are these elite enemies at? Dude's already coming out. Oh damn, ally bonus conditions. Defeat, I haven't even seen these before. Okay, hang on. Okay, dudes are all the way over there. Damn, I wanted to kill the guys that are in this base first. Then what is this shit? Ally bonus conditions? Defeat an officer with a chain above a certain number. Okay, mm-hmm. Air juggle him for five seconds and then kill him. Oh yeah, we can we can definitely do that. I'm unable to decline these kinds of requests. Come on, come on, horse. Fuck, where's my horse at? Come on, what are you waiting for? Back the fuck the up. Started. There we go. Damn. You gotta go kill Oh, I can't even get out there. I gotta kill these dicks first. Bitches. Also found out if you mash Y. And X when you do that, it gets it up really fucking quick. Bitches, out of my way. Where did his dick go? Where did he go? Where did he go? Ah! Bah, 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 bah. Get the fuck out. You didn't know Lu Bu could use Tompas, did you, bitch? Out of my way. I got some assholes I gotta kill up ahead. Oh, that gatekeeper's in for some trouble. Bitch, you best open the gate. Oh. God, I love that attack. Brigadier General. <clears throat> Give me the materials. Boom. It's like the fist of God coming down. Twin axes are actually really fun because when they block, you can just do your uh, your third charge move, and it goes straight through blocks 
As long as peons don't get in the fucking way of it, out of my way, you bitches! I'm trying to kill this brigandier general and all these fucking peons keep jumping in front of the axe. Down you go. Okay. Those bitches are dead. Oh my god. Fuck you, archers. I'm trying to get my juggles. Oh, you bitches. Now peasants are being attacked? Why do I gotta say peasants? I want, like, handmaidens again. Alright. Oh, wait. Watch it. Oh, here goes Zushu with his Omni Slash. Oh, just fucking ruined that guy. That was awesome. I didn't even... That's pretty cool. You know, you're never really, like, sitting around just waiting for an officer to do their special. But, uh, yeah, actually, I really like the Twin Axes as just, like, a core weapon on Lubu. Like, I mean, given how obviously still run the Halberd as his main, the Twin Axes, they fit in nicely as a secondary. Cause it's like when you got that one bitch that keeps blocking, you're just like, nah, sorry, bro, my charge attack goes through that. You can fuck them up. On top of that, they, they fit in with the, the Whirlwind theme. Assassins? You guys needed to send assassins to kill some peasants? I killed one dude. It's like, you did it! You rescued him! I'm like, uh, okay. I guess. The fuck did I get out of here? No, this way. Alright, so I had... It's the first time I noticed those optional objectives. I'm trying to remember, I gotta do a... Kill an officer on my chains. Hi. Uh, there was a juggle one and a defeat quickly. I got the defeat quickly one. I gotta find out what it actually is, because I'm sure they're like, defeat him with a chain above a certain length, it's something like, you know, you need to have a, I don't know, a chain at 500. Or a chain at, I don't know. I mean, I, I doubt it you have to have one at 1,000 to do it, because there's like an achievement for getting a chain to 1,000, but either way, it's definitely something right up Zhu Shu's corner. Um, I'm actually pretty fucking excited now. Like, after playing through and getting him, or playing with him in Shu, I, I managed to get a 9999 chain, and I was like, holy shit, this guy is fucking monstrous. So, for those skills that, like, where you need to get chains, he is a straight boss at taking care of those. Oh, damn it. I didn't want to kill you yet. I wanted to juggle you. Oh, well. You're dead. No! Fuck, he landed. Actually, let's try these. These might be better for, for keeping him juggled. No, damn it. I went to my storm rush. No! Oh, fucking... Oh, man. Alright, let's try that again. We're gonna get this. No. Damn it. Oh, fucking... These assholes keep getting in my way. Ruining it. Bitch! Get the... Fuck out of here. What is this? Materials. Oh, Storm Rush with Tomfas. Who's the main enemy commander, anyway? Oh! Wow. Well, I guess the chain didn't have to be that high. But, uh, yeah, that looks good. Success across the board. Um, Fu Fang is the main asshole we're killing here. Where does he go? Where's, where's, uh, where's Zhu Shu at? I want to get a fucking... There we go. Yeah, I got my double. No, oh, damn it. Can I, I want to keep that while jumping. Do, like, the double Musao Armageddon Strike style. Oh, maybe I can't. Fuck it. We'll just ruin his shit this way. 
Boom! Biatch! Bah! I feel I can grow stronger by working with you. Fuck! I didn't crack open the box yet! Damn it! Why didn't I crack open the box first? Yeah, but Tomfas and Twin Axes, both, uh, both pretty baller. I'm actually, uh, a really big fan of both the, the flail and the wheels. Once I get somebody that can use those, I'll be, uh, I'll be yanking those out. Alright, allies, we need more fame. Need more fame. And the mace, I haven't actually unlocked the mace yet. And I know uh, one guy used to be the mace dude in the previous games. This time around he has a, uh, it's basically like a canoe. So, um, not sure if there's a mace. But we'll see. I mean, like I said, wheels will definitely come out. Flail will definitely come out. Uh, javelin I was playing around with. The guy that uses the javelin is a straight baller. So if I actually like unlock him, that would be pretty sweet. But we'll see what happens. Otherwise, like the first like spear guy I get, I'm sure he'll have uh, compatibility with the javelin. And I'll tell you what, though, consecutive missions staying on hard, they get pretty fucking crazy. I know the, uh, I'm trying to remember the guy's name. I want to say his name is Deadman. Oh, he's one of the viewers, but he was the same person that had mentioned to me about red hair being at 80 battles in, or 90 battles in. He's saying we're going to have to we're gonna go for it. You pretty much have to start on beginner just because of how like retarded strong the enemies become. And I mean, we're only on our second battle. Given we're on hard, you can definitely see that uh, the strength of the enemy certainly does ramp up. And one thing I noticed as well, I'm not sure if it's just like if it has to do with like the character I'm using or what the deal is, but like I know I have that perk for um, you know you're supposed to. Hang on, where's it at? Where's it at? Where the fuck am I going? Weapons. Oh yeah, health gauge will recover somewhat with each successful attack. Level 5, right? Look at my health gauge. Oh shit. Oh, I didn't want to do that, but... We're going to look at my health gauge here. I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy, but it does not look like my health gauge is moving whatsoever. And I would consider those all successful attacks. And I know the ones that are like defeat an enemy, I've seen those work. Like I've seen my rage gauge increase or my uh, musel gauge increase or health increase, but the whole your shit increases with the attacks, I just don't think, I don't know if it's like broken or what the deal is, but yeah. Clearly right there, beating the shit out of these dudes, health not increasing. Out of my way, gatekeeper. Like that time it increased. Get off my ass, fucking dicks. I, mean, I think maybe because it's level five, it's like the chance of it actually going off just isn't very high or Stand up, bitch. Alright. Elite enemy units are down. To the handmaidens. Oh, this way. I'm coming, handmaidens. I wonder what's wrong with them. I wonder what's attacking them. Just bad guys? Oh, tigers. It's a good thing Lou Boo's here. Those tigers would fuck up a handmaiden. Just uppercut a tiger. Oh, 
Only Lu Bu is badass enough to straight run up on a fucking bunch of tigers and beat the shit out of them. Bitch, who the fuck? Get, get your ass down. Call Pete on me for all I care. I'm rescuing some handmaidens. Okay, well, definitely not going to defeat an officer when my health gauge is full. Storm Rush, it's possible. And the uh, chain combo, that's certainly possible. Let's run over to these douches up ahead and see if we can pull this off. The one soldier. Actually, we're going to run into this barracks real quick, see if there's a uh, materials chest. Come on, chest. Uh, nothing? Oh, I guess it's not every barracks. Out of my way, bitches. Oh, there's my Storm Rush defeat. No, really? He didn't die to that? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What is this? No! Oh, my God! Fuck! Ooh, there we go. Fuck off! There's my storm rush. Oh man, my health is like non-existent at the moment. And that was that was meat. Was that meat? That's a weapon. Fuck! I need something to heal with. Fuck off, mobile unit captain. Okay, don't got the chain. This area is all mine. Man, I really need some. I wonder if these Tomfas hang out. Let's see if my Tomfas have, uh. No, Tomfas do not have recovery. So we're pretty much riding on hopes that our. Okay, this healed us up a little bit there. We need a lot more health. And it's not looking good. Anyway, we're gonna grab this this time around. Got the materials. The bitch is retreating. Please health be inside this pot. XP. I'll take a free storm rush to fuck this dude up. Oh, finally got determination. Do as you please with me. All right. So we got one more battle to unlock some officers. And basically no health. So, yeah, shit's about to go down. Fame has reached its maximum value. Man. on. So the fame obtained will be discarded. The limit for fame depends on the number of facilities you have. By making new facilities appear, you can increase your fame. You can obtain allies by defeating enemy officers in great battles. Why is that part added in? Like, it talks about, you know, like, alright, your fame's at its limit. You need more facilities to get more fame. And then it's like, you can get allies by defeating officers. Like, really? No shit. We knew that. Either way, I mean, we need... We need fucking another battle. Here we go. We need this duel. We need some people. We can't have our dudes all assigned to the to the shit there are now, and then we can never switch out. I don't know how well this duel's gonna go with Lubu being on fucking red health, but uh, we'll fucking find out. Oh, I'm on orange health, and oh man, there are a bunch of people on this map. I'm gonna have to ask you to fuck off. Storm Rush! I 
feel like there's archers hitting me. Damn, another storm rush. Lou Boo straight fucking pimp mode. I'm going to get my whole determination done here. Bitches, back the fuck up. All right. Whew. What's the mission info here? Oh. Defeat an officer with a chain. Got it. Defeat an officer with a storm rush. Got it. Switch counter. That one's going to be fucking hard. Um, all right. Lee Dian. I'm not a big fan of using him, but he is pretty fucking good. Uh, Peng Days. All right. No idea who the fuck you are. Yu Jin. So you. And Cao Hong. All right. Let's, um, where are we going first? Break through the enemy defensive line. Oh, okay, it's four. Hang on, Peng Day. I think I remember who he is. Wang Yi, don't know you. Where's the other ones at? I don't know. Fuck it. We'll just we'll get him as we find him. Let's um let's kill the guy in here first. Or what was the what was the enemy line shit? Off my shit, mobile unit captain. Armageddon strike! I wish I like went full health when I leveled up. Oh, you! Damn, yeah, this bitch is awesome. She has some fucking dirty Musou attacks. Like, really dirty attacks. Yeah, I want you in my army. Fuck yeah. You are very welcome to Lubu's army of awesomeness. But first, bitch, you got a duel. Oh, and it missed. Let's try that again. This time you got. I got you. I got you. Yeah. Join Lu Bu's army of awesomeness, Wang Yi. You will join, and you will fuck up your shit with me. Back the fuck up, mobile unit captain. We don't got time for your shit. Okay, Wang Yi's down. Let's run over. We gotta go get this. There's a shit ton of guys coming from the east. We're gonna go take them out next. So the one benefit of having your health in red is your moose out gauge is just like never ending. No, see my fool. Why you gotta leave us like that? I'm feeling stronger than I normally do. Oh, okay. You Jin, now I now I know who he is. Yay, with the hook blades. Mr. Hook Blades. Yeah, we can welcome you into the Lubu army. Like relearning like half these guys. So I played uh played through Wei first. And I actually never really played Eugene. I tried him and just didn't really like the the twin hooks. I mean, he's awesome for one-on-ones, but I didn't like the, uh, I mean, his, like, AoE capabilities are kind of weak, so. Never really got into him, but, uh, I mean, considering all these other pussy-ass officers are fleeing, I'll definitely take him into the army. Fuck off, Sao Hong. What's this? Fury hook? Bitch. Oh shit. Not, not, no! Oh man. Damn. I did not really mean to moose out there, but I saw him, uh. Actually, I wonder if he's low enough that I can. Hang on, we're gonna try something here that's probably ill advisable, but I need to defeat the enemy with a switch counter, so. I wonder if I can pull this off. Let's see if that counted. Oh, really? Fuck, it didn't. Eat a dick! Oh, come on. How is that not on top of him? God, I hate when it, that doesn't, like, line up perfect. It's like, oh, so you were off by, like, a quarter of an inch. Please, allow me to join you. I have failed. I need the rest of you. 
Man, all these bitches are failing, failing, failing. Like, God, why is my army so shitty? Look, Pang Tong's chilling. Zhu Shu's chilling. Juge Rong and Fu Wan. Well, Fu Wan looks like he's about to get fucking overrun. Um, what do they got left? Just Li Dian and Pang Dei. Alright. We gotta go, uh, go take this bitch out. Before. I should probably, like, run into the base. Or at least run over to this guy in the west that has just, like, a giant army of red on top of him. Just to make sure they don't, like, destroy him. Let's see how many guys you actually got over here with you. Where the hell you at? Oh, wow, dude. Fu Wan getting fucking wrecked. I better, yeah, I better save his ass. Come on, Fu Wan. Why can't you be a badass like Lu Bu? Lu Bu's slaughtering everything. This bitch can barely even stand up. Hoping that with the mobile unit captain's dead, he can survive just these basic shit troops. And I'm kind of, I'm definitely going back to the tiger. I like switched up to the wolf, thinking it would be kind of badass. I mean, the damage is lower than the tiger, but I was like, whatever, we'll bring Mr. Wolf out. And so far, he hasn't done anything. He's just like stared. He's just standing around like a fucking puppy dog. All right, fuck it. He can take care of your ass. I'm going for these generals. Am I across this? Is this like a river? I guess we'll find out in a second. Uh, what are you guarding? Materials? Really? There's a gatekeeper and there's no materials inside? What kind of garbage is that? Why would anyone want to ransack? Can I cross this? Yes, I can. Alright. So... Gotta fight Pang Day. Got no fucking health. Oh shit! Don't hit me! Fuck. He's behind me. I fucked that up. Oh, that's not gonna work. I have a disadvantage with that weapon. Oh, there we go. Boom! There we go. Oh shit! Learn a skill, Halberd and Determination level 4. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Where is... So, able to use Whirlwind when a Halberd is equipped. We already know this skill. Hmm. Well, I already used Whirlwind on like half of my abilities. Oh, wait, what was, what was that shit? Acquired a weapon? Resonant? What? what? Whoa, 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 whoa. Where'd where that, where that weapon go? Recently obtained. Don't need those. I'm gonna do some quick weapon cleaning. Don't need this. Where the fuck's that new thing I obtained? Uh, 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 uh. Blade. Don't need you. Damn. That's fucking sexy. Cloudburst. Get rid of these old ones. Don't need you. Don't need you. Don't need you or you. Damn, so much shit. I'm gonna have to go through this list later. Where the fuck is that? Damn it, I wanna find that thing I just got. I don't even know what it was called. It was like some crazy... No, it's not a halberd. What the fuck was it? What the fuck did I obtain? I don't see it anywhere. I figured I got like some like level fucking 5 weapon that was all super badass, but no, apparently not. Just more show, oh, here we go, Resonant Ambition. It's the mace. Huh. But it's a level 1 version. Fuck you, shitty level 1 version mace. Soaring Blade is going to be nice. I needed a level 3 of that. 
We can get rid of this old shit and what the new wheel we had. Uh, yep. Our other one's better. Alright. Well, I was hoping we got like a fucking pimp ass halber, but I guess not. Either way, Peng Day is part of our army now. Time to go. F oh, really? Really, asshole? You're gonna close that gate? You're gonna make me run around and whoop your ass from the other side of it. Either way, we got uh, we got that halberd skill. I'm gonna look more into that. Cause I feel like I already, as you can see, I'm already getting like whirlwinds off my attacks. Though I think that might just be because of the twin axes. What the fuck! Get the hell out of here, you shitty base captain. He's actually pretty strong for like a peon type guy. Alright. Into Lee DM we go. Let's see how um what happened to Pang Tong actually? Did Pang Tong like Oh wow, Pang Tong fled too. Damn, I really do not pay enough attention to my own army. But like half of them were pussies and like the only other guy I had up there was Pang Tong. Pang Tong is fucking strategist. You can't just leave him to defend the main camp. Like, come on. Let me fucking pick what generals are going into this battle. I am Lee Dian, your worst nightmare. I don't know about that. Nope, that missed. Alright, Lee Dian. I'm gonna need you to... Stand still so I can ruin your shit with this real fast. Damn. He was like, okay, oh my god! If you say you want me to fucking exploded you, that I'll guy's asshole. Alright. Your fame has reached max limit. Yeah, we know. Thanks. Horse statue. Horse racing across the battlefield. It looks like a horse about to, like, rape a frog or something. Anyway, let's get back to camp. We got some new officers. We're going to switch around some uh, some positions of people. I kind of like having Zushu with me. But I'll see what abilities these guys have. Day, Wang Yi, Yu Jin, Li Dian, and your fame increased. Blah blah blah. Fame details bullshit. Alright. Um let's see. Bodyguard. Energy, recovery. Like I, I, that's the thing, like what the hell's the difference between healing and recovery? I'm guessing energy gives you moose out. Rally usually like does badass stuff. Stude also gives healing. Growth? What is growth? I like rally. I don't know what energy does. Either way, we'll, um, I don't have to mess around with them, but, um, for now, oh, where am I at? I wanted to go to change officer. Oh, hang on. Camp management, where is he at? Right now, Zushu is watching the barracks. Alright, so we're gonna fuck the altar. Put a baller-ass horse statue here. Barracks. Mm, who'd be good at the barracks? Fang D looks like a good barracks guy. And we're gonna change it up to. What the fuck? What is he in charge of? Oh, he's my bodyguard. Damn it, you son of a bitch. Alright, new fucking pick anybody. Do you. Now I can change my officer to Zushu finally. Damn. Baller horse statue. We got Zusu in the lineup. And then, of course, the bodyguard is a fucking obvious choice, Lu Bu. Who else would I possibly bring as a bodyguard? Oh, man. Either way, guys, that's going to be it for episode four. Um, yeah. This is probably going to be a uh, like Monday, Wednesday, Friday type series, but either way... Figured, uh, I felt like playing a little bit of ambition, so I decided I'd toss one up for the weekend for you guys. But hope you enjoyed this one. Make sure to look forward to next episode. We're going to have a little Zushu action, and we'll probably be uh, pulling out another one of the requested weapons. So, as always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys at the next episode.